Electronica 2022. I'm here with Alex here on the Renaissance stand. We're talking wireless connectivity, IoT, industrial. Now, it's been four years since we were at Electronica exactly, last. Yeah, yeah, yeah. A lot has changed. Yeah. So what would you say is the most innovative thing that's happened since the last Electronica? That's, that's, a, that's a very tough question because a lot of things have happened in four years' time. For sure. Uh, we have launched a, a couple of new generations of BLE. Uh, the, the Wi-Fi portfolio has been increased. We got a lot more new modules. Uh, we now also are a, a uh, LTE uh, solution, right. a module. And uh, last but not least, we have a uh, Wi-Fi uh, 6E solution oh, really? for, for high-end uh, access points and the peripheral solutions. That's quite exciting. Uh, yeah. It certainly is enabling a lot more connectivity. Yes, exactly. Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 So how is this and these innovations, the different wireless levels, how is that all in helping us to empower a greener future? Well, I think all the products are empowering, but especially the, the blue to low energy. Uh, this is all about low power. Just having a very small battery, a coin cell battery that runs an application for years. So we take every nano amp and make it into a wireless connection. The Wi-Fi uh, solution that we have are mm -hmm. called Virtually Zero. Right. And this is one of the, the, the lowest powers. Actually, it's the lowest power Wi-Fi solution that can handle uh, a Wi-Fi connection, a stable Wi-Fi connection, running on a battery also for years. And this enables uh, smart home type of applications where you have a door lock, which is not mains connected, but just battery connected. And it runs oh, okay. on a battery for years. So that's also green. Yeah. It, it is. What other sort of applications would be used with that sort of a battery life, do you think? Yeah, as I said, smart home applications. Yep. So uh, ranging from uh, sensor type of applications, uh, uh, smoke detectors, but door, lock, door locks also. Um, same for the Bluetooth uh, solutions. You can have the smallest sensors uh, that you can uh, do uh, uh, pollution detection even right uh, but not only for smart home but for also for industrial type of applications where you have a, a, a warehouse uh, and you want to detect where your equipment is you can use the BLE uh, solutions I and see. especially the uh, the protocols that we can run on top like wireless ranging and then you can measure the distance between two different nodes in a in a warehouse situation okay. that's also quite new so not only the, the hardware but also the software is uh, something that we yeah. provide yeah. So if I were to ask you for just one takeaway from what you're talking about here, what's the one thing you want people to remember? The one thing that people would remember is it's, it's going to be a long sentence, but right? actually <laughs> Renesis, we have a, a full range of wireless technologies uh, going from blue to low energy, a Wi-Fi, a high performance Wi-Fi, LTE, and we're not only providing the silicon, but also the software, the modules, and also in production, we have the right tools to get you into mass production. So really it is like a one-stop one stop shop. That's hard to say. You're a one-stop shop and you can really help the customer to get the full solution, whether it's hardware or software. Exactly. Cool. Thank you very much for talking to You're me welcome. today. Thank you.